everybody out there right now. It is January 30th, meaning I have six days until my first high school dance ever. I would have gone freshman and sophomore year, except it got canceled because of COVID. So junior year is the first high school dance I'm ever going to, and I have no idea what to expect. Yay! I'm bringing you guys along with the process of getting my outfits, my shoes, that type of stuff. But don't worry, because the dance in six days, I do already have my full outfit planned. I wanted to show you guys my options of the dresses I could have worn because I actually have three that I got. I already know which one I'm gonna wear, but I'm just gonna show you guys the options anyway. Because all of them are really cute and I could wear any of them. I'm lucky to have three options to choose from. The first two I'm gonna try on are from Lucy in the Sky. I'll have all of these linked below in case you like one of them a lot. This is the first dress. I got this one in an extra small online. I really liked the color of this. I love the one sleeve. Obviously, I love the sparkles. My only issue with this dress is it is really close to my skin color. Like, if I were to be like 100 feet away, like, would you be able to tell that I was wearing a dress? Because it's like that close to my skin color. This is not my favorite. If you're going to buy this one, know that it is see-through. Like, it, it just isn't see-through, so. This was my second choice. Because I do really like it. I don't know, this would be such a cute birthday outfit though. So maybe stay tuned for that. Outfit number one. Here's the second dress. This one's also from Lucy in the Sky. Both of the ones I got from there are an extra small. And this one just feels a lot more comfortable, if that makes sense. It has a zipper and it just feels like a little more stretchy. I don't know if it actually is, but it's just more comfortable to like move around in. And I like the way this looks with my skin tone a lot better. It still has the one sleeve. I like the red. It feels a little like Christmassy-ish, but I think it will work for a February dance since it is kind of close to Valentine's Day. My only complaint, which I don't think anyone would really notice, is because there's a zipper right here. It's like something that sticks out like right there. I don't know if you can actually see it, but it annoys me. This is my final dress. I'm pretty happy with it. I love the sparkles. This is the one that I'm gonna go with. I think it's really cute. I just don't know how I'm gonna do my hair with it. We'll see when we get there. But I have one more dress to try on. I'm not gonna wear this one, but I think it's still a cute option that I can have linked below for you guys that is on the cheaper side. Let's do it. This dress is from H&M. This has always been like my backup dress. I got this one first and I was planning on wearing this if I didn't find anything else. I feel like this one needs a little bit of alterations on me like i want to get these straps taken up a little bit and i also want to get the waist taken in just because i like stuff that like tightens around my waist this one was i think it was 35 dollars my only complaint is just i want to get it taken in a little bit it has the sparkles so it'd be so cute with like a little jacket wait a second i know it's so cute. If it was just taken up a little bit with this jacket, this would be a birthday outfit, actually. This would be so cute. To go to dinner, that is my third and final dress that I got. I'm gonna go with the red one, but the other options are really cute too, and everything is linked below in the description box if you wanna go get it for yourself. I also wanna show you guys my shoes that I got. So this is the box that my shoes came in. They're from Amazon, but I've test tried them all already. They're great quality, and I think they'd be less expensive than shoes that I would buy from like Nordstrom's or something. So these were a great purchase, and I can honestly wear them with a lot of different dances since, you know, you can change your dress, but I don't really think you have to change your heels. Is that a thing? Like, do you buy heels for every single dance? I don't know. This is my first time going to a high school dance. Here we go. Aren't they pretty? I wanted to go with more of a gold theme. I feel like gold would go with the red really well. They're so cute with this dress.
These are what they look like in the mirror. I really like the way they cross in the front. I think that makes them pretty unique looking. I really like them. I think they're only three inches high, so they're really easy to walk in. I think a mosquito just bit me in the middle of the face, but it's the day of the dance, guys. And I'm freezing. This weekend, I've had four ballet shows. Well, today is my fourth, actually. So yesterday I had two and I was at the theater all day long, literally all day long. So when I got home last night, I was gonna take a shower, get all this makeup off, but I never did. I ended up falling asleep early because I think I'm just like so physically tired. I don't even know. I need to take a shower now, get this makeup off. I have another show today that I will be running from. Once it ends, I'm literally going straight home to get ready for the dance. So I need to get ready. <laughs> I need to prepare everything. So when I am running home from the performance, I can just get ready and go to the dance. I don't want to be that late. Because I've been in constant performances, I have had no nail polish on because I'm not allowed to go on stage with nail polish. Because I'm wearing pointy shoes on stage, I can paint my toenails. <laughs> and I'll probably paint my nails like on the way to the dance because I really want my nails to be painted. So I'll make it happen, but I can do my toenails before I have to perform today. So no one's gonna see them. But my dress is red, sparkly. So I don't want to do my nails red because I feel like they would clash, but I don't want to do them gold because all my accents are gold. So like white, I'm doing my nails this color. It looks pretty dark, but it actually matches when you put it next to the dress. So I'll do my toenails right now. And then when I'm rushing between ballet, performance and the dance, I'll do my nails. I think for jewelry, I'm going to wear this pair of earrings. And then wear this ring. I don't think I need a necklace because of like the neckline of my dress. So I think this is all I'm gonna wear, honestly. Okay, okay, okay. Hello people, we are back home. And I need to take out my hair quickly. This is going to be a very fast. Get ready with me because I obviously had a performance before this. It went well though. My bun today though, was so good for no reason. It was really flat. I was proud of it today. I really hope my hair will look okay. It's gonna look bad at first, I know that. I just gotta work with it, you know? So cute. You see this? You see this? Are you excited? Are you excited? Uh, What's up, Philon? <laughs> Full's going. I'm not ready at all. Why does my hair look like that? It's look how fluffy going, my hair is. Show me your dress. It's on my bed. Way too fluffy. My hair never is this fluffy. Why is it so fluffy? My hair's kind of getting a little fluffy, at least in the front. I'm gonna put water in it. Please be better now. Okay, I gotta let this dry now because now it's wet. <laughs> I'm gonna go eat. I have 30 minutes, guys. 30 minutes. <laughs> it comes in my like, quick makeup. I already have on mm -hmm. mascara. We're gonna reapply that. I do very natural makeup when I do wear makeup, so I'm not doing anything crazy at all. I think that's blended in. I literally don't know. And <laughs> whatever. I think that's good enough. I just added like a little sparkle to my eyelashes. I mean, eyelids. <laughs> I'm gonna put some blush on and get my mascara. And I need to do my nails. Okay, look at the difference between this one that I redid and that one. Crazy. Outfit. I think I'm ready. The nails are done. I did them in five minutes. Wow. We need the flashlight. 